Saka versus Foden. Part 3. So in the last part you guys once again wanted them both to stay at their current clubs. So they are still here. Let's see how they'll do. Manchester City got third and Arsenal got fifth in the Premier League. Manchester City did win the Community Shield, but neither of them could win the FA Cup or Carabao Cup. Arsenal won the UEFA Super Cup, and Manchester City actually got grouped in the Champions League and lost in the Europa League quarterfinals. And Arsenal lost the Champions League final. Saka could have won back-to-back -back Champions League trophies for Arsenal. Saka got 20 goals with 16 assists, and Phil Foden got 17 goals and 9 assists. The Euros is coming up and they have already won it in the series so let's see if they can do it again. England lost in the semi-finals to Spain. Saka got three goals with one assist and Foden got one goal only. Arsenal got third in the league and City could only get fifth. So they basically just switched places from the previous season. Neither could win the FA Cup or the Carabao Cup. Arsenal lost in the Europa League round of 16 to Salzburg which is crazy and Manchester City lost in the Champions League round of 16 to Roma. Saka got 26 goals and 7 assists. And Foden got 28 goals with 7 assists. So the top comment decides their next club. And yes I have still banned Ajax and Real Sociedad. Dad.